What's going on? What's going on, y'all? How y'all feeling? D Star back again. Let me see. Week 11? Week 11 in the NFL right now? Week 11, we got the Saints Sunday. 425. Hmm. Four and five right now. Four and five right now. The question today is uh happy Wednesday, first of all. And then also folks say uh Carson Wentz uh, is doing too much. I would I would say he's having to do too much because uh Mike Grow and Press Taylor, they're not uh they're not up to snuff, man. They're not bringing nothing to the table. You see him go out seven straight games, he's making the same mistake. Making the same mistake. Seven straight games. He's turning the ball over. That should be emphasized. That should be emphasized right now. Especially, you know. Yeah, that should be emphasized right now. Especially where we want to go. Where we're trying to go. We're trying to go to the playoffs, right? How are we going to the playoffs if our quarterback keep on turning the ball over? And it's not being addressed by the coaches. Same thing when it comes to our tackling. Same thing when it comes to our uh, our penalties, but we played a clean game this past week, but we still lost because we can't get uh, you know what I mean. We he has to have confidence in himself. Carson has to have confidence in himself, and not just confidence in a couple guys, just Alshon and and um Ertz. Come on now, you got Golden Tate, you got Aguilar, you got Goddard. You got other weapons to use. Use them. Josh Adams, if you feel like Josh Adams should be behind you more, say that. Dog, you the quarterback. Be vocal about that shit. Let these folks know, man, hey, listen, I'm trying to win, bro. And I'm not down like you say. Losing is not in my DNA. That's something I respect about Carson. Because that ain't what we about neither. We about winning, baby. We about winning. Even if we're not winning Super Bowls every single year, we want to be in contention. We want to be in contention at the end of the day so folks can respect that. Even if you hate us, you will respect that about us. Damn, that's a hard-working team. Last year, we were a hard-working team. This year, we're trying to get off without working. We're trying to get off and just show up. Hey, the champ's here. Okay. Y'all gonna play like champs or y'all gonna play like chumps? Discipline. Guys aren't disciplined enough with their eyes to see what's going on. Uh, missing gaps. Missing tackles. Missing plays. Missing interceptions. Kamu, he still should have caught that with a cast on his hand and all. Why is he in the game if he got a cast on his hand? Put somebody else in the game. Cause somebody else, if they was in that in, in that uh at, in that play, guess what? They would have caught that and took it to the crib. That's a momentum builder. Pick six, boom. Especially at the link in all black, nighttime. Come on, dog. Crowd gonna go nuts. But shit, how they gonna go nuts without you giving them something to cheer for? See what I'm saying? The crowd don't play the game for y'all. That's something y'all forgetting. Y'all forgetting to go out and play. It's oh yeah, we at home. Okay, we're going to sit back. Like y'all say, y'all got the checks, right? Jordan, 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 Jordan Hicks got the checks, huh? He can check into anything he want, right? Just like he checked into that blitz, that casino blitz that we had. When Razul gave up the first down on the slant. See what I'm saying? So why don't you check out of that sticks defense sometime on third and long, fourth and long, and say, hey, we finna send a couple, couple, you know what I mean? Couple blitzers. We finna sit a little bit more than you can handle in your offensive line and your max protect. We coming after you. We coming after you. We not finna sit back. All this sitting back, that's why you're sitting at four and five. All that sitting back, that's why you're not six and three. That's why you're not seven and two. That's why you're not eight and one. That's why you're not nine and zero. Oh. You're not taking these teams seriously. They're in the NFL just like you. They get paid just like you. They just don't have what you have. Okay? They just don't have what you have. But far as our coaching, oh, it's coming in the real question now. Coming in the real question. 
and uh it'll be quite it'll be answered by six seven o'clock sunday night we will know we will know if these coaches still have their heads stuck in their ass we will know guys we will know i'll come back with uh how we can beat the saints on sunday because we the type of team that was looking ahead that's what we were doing we were looking ahead we were looking ahead even last year when we played seattle we were looking ahead to the rams game See what I'm saying? You talking to somebody that watches this team, that studies this team. Studies this team. Yeah. So, I'll be back to let you know a little bit more about what's about what's really going on with the team. You know what I mean? What I think what I think other things we need to work on at the end of the day.